I'm gonna go show the one out of the water and then I'm gonna go ahead and set it up. Tomorrow, we're gonna ride it. Perfect. Yeah, it'll do uh, 40 knots. 40 knots, guys. With 1,000 foot-pounds. 1,000 foot-pounds. Listen, what, look me up on YouTube. Alfred Montaner on YouTube. You got it. All right, guys. Cheers, Alfred. Thank you. All right, guys. Oh, my goodness. This is gonna happen, guys. Full electric. How sick is that I can put an ATV on there? I, I might have to come in an ATV. All right, guys. So, listen. We're starting this video out. It's a little interesting. You know, I like to do things that are interesting and different. Um, so here's the thing, right? One of the reasons why I come to the show, I want you guys to see everything that was at the show because, you know, sometimes you don't get to see it all. Because look at that. They literally put Stingray over here in the nosebleeds uh, section of the boat show. But no fear, Alfred's here. Let me change the... Let me change that a little bit. All right, guys. So listen, we're going to walk as far as we can to the front and show you guys some of these boats. If you see something you like, comment below. We'll try to find pricing if there is some pricing on these boats. But look, we got a Stingray right here, 2021 Stingray 191 DC, 37K. 37,000, guys. What do you guys think? It's got a little 115 Suzuki. Here's another Stingray. You know what? I'll, I'll give, I'll give a check. What do you guys think? Let's see what this. So this, this one that we just passed was under 50k. And uh, we got another Stingray here. What's up, guys? How you guys doing? So here's uh, Boat World of Florida. Represent this one. This one's 54,000. It's a 150 Yamaha. Yamaha. Yeah. That is so cool. All right, guys. So, like I said, they have them out here in the distance. And we're walking. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to walk. We kind of did a live stream of what was going on on the docks. So I'll link that video to this one. But here's that electric boat that we were just watching in the water. What is up with that? They're putting RVs now in boat shows? Okay, so this is 100% electric, guys. Oh, I definitely got to try to do a, a sea trial on this. Look at this. So did you guys see when he was pressing the bow thruster? There it is. There it is. And it's called X X Shore. Look at this entrance. All right, so um, some of you guys saw the Tampa show that I did a video of this particular boat, which was super different. Definitely want to see that again. This is a PRJ, PRJ boats, super cool boats. Look at this Garwood. So this is a 28 foot custom runabout. Oh my goodness, look at this guys. All right. So it looks, let me show you guys what this looks like. Dude, this is already like art. I mean, think about this, look at this. How sick is this? Oh my goodness, that is so cool. I mean, I could just picture just hanging out, drinking some wine on this. How sick is this? So different, dude. Making memories, Oak Island. We got some blackwood over here, guys. Uh, Shearwater. Let me go ahead and talk to them over there in the front. Wow. And we continue the walk, guys. Uh, to be honest with you, I have not seen many boats that are under 100K. What's going on, Gables Motorsports? What's going on, Alfred? Man, 
What is going on here at Palm Beach? Nothing but sheer waters, baby. Blackwood, sheer water, come on down, come visit us. Work you a great deal on a great boat. So do you have any inventory? That's the main question everybody's asking. Absolutely. You do? Absolutely. So what do you have available? We got the uh, Blackwood sheer waters, the 22s, the 25s, the 26s, the 270s, uh, Blackwood 27. All right. Uh, and we have other, other brands available, so. All right, guys. So we're gonna check you out at Gables, GablesMarine.com? GablesMarine.com. All right, guys. Hey, Thank check you. them out. We're gonna catch. You. We're gonna catch you on there. You better give them a good price. Absolutely. All right, guys. So you got more over here. You got plantation boat over here representing. They're over here. What's up, guys? What do you guys got back here? Sea hunt boats. Sea hunt. Yes, and we have the only 250 new Yamaha on the entire show. The only 250? New. The I saw the 300 here too. Yeah. So that's interesting because there, there is none out there. You won't see one in the entire show. All right, so where are you going to be uh, around 8 o'clock? <laughs> Let me know, bros. I'll be right here. <laughs> <laughs> Smart man. I'm going to be holding on to the side. <laughs> you're not going anywhere. So, it actually belong to somebody who was nice enough to let me bring it to the show. So I know this 250 and the 300 were, I mean, they're like, non-existent right there's still not a lot of them out there a lot of people want them there's just a handful of them out they've probably been out in the market for about 10 days two weeks at the most this, this is the brand new steering just like the 425 they have uh improved the uh the reverse the thrust is twice as strong so when you put it on reverse it's completely they, they rerouted the exhaust mm -hmm. and by that they gained twice the thrust in reverse completely game changer so so you got the sea hunt here it, so this is a customer's boat this is a customer's boat yeah well it's a really nice guy let me bring it out here wow yeah i need friends like your customer dude yeah. you, you get you got you got good customers man and that guy that also that's mr cabrera over there very nice little clean their boat here well you know one of the things that they're having a lot of people are having a problem um with inventory right so yeah. Uh, everybody is bringing in i know well listen but you can make a boat right you can make a boat i can make a boat i just got seven customers for the one boat that's all <laughs> all right guys well listen right, you're you. gonna see yourself check out alfred montana on the chit show you got a, you got a card or something Ch check out alfred montana chit show you'll see it trust me alfred montana the chit show you'll see it look me up on youtube all right cool hey and you got you got mercury right there man that's the new v12 that just came out this is it's in here yeah, it's right all right guys we got we got Mercury over here with the 600. Oh my goodness. Hold on, guys. Let me show you guys what's crazy about this, guys. Wow. Oh, man. So this is what makes this a game changer, guys. This right here. You see how this will turn... And the, the actual boat, the motor, the outboard stays upright. It does not move. That's why this is incredible. Dual prop. So here's what it looks like inside. So some of you guys want to get an idea of what it's looking like. Oh, yeah. Look at this. That is super nice. Thank you. All right, guys. So, if you want to get an idea of what we got going on under the hood, they actually left it completely open. Now, here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to do a video of the Valhalla 46 that has quad. Um, quad uh, outboards on their channel and uh look how big it looks guys this gentleman is about maybe i would say six six one six two crazy that is awesome well listen we're gonna do more videos of the 600 but i definitely wanted to stop in there to show you guys that and uh it was a nice little treat we got a vice yacht over here hello how are you so what do we have here? We have here a new Bent and the first boat with this brand. It's the first one ever? Yes. 
So what is it called? Vice Yachts? Can I go up there and look at it? All right, guys. So we just got, so I think about it. We got a 600 V12 and, uh, and now we got the Vice Yacht over here. Whoa. 70 miles per hour. 70 miles an hour? Come this on, boat? Look, come on. Can you want me to take off my shoes? No, I'm, I'm good. All right, guys. Welcome aboard. So, All yeah, right. We try to mix some like fast boat, but also like having open space on the front, like a couple seats. Got, uh, wow, look how high the, the gunnel, like the freeboard is on so high here. How high is this? Like what, five, four feet, four and a half feet from here? Mm, probably around four. Wow. So like this is a perfect uh, go fast kid boat. Uh, I'll show the cabin now. So where are you guys making these? New Jersey. New Jersey? Yeah. And you said this is the first one ever? No, the first, but first we also doing Booty Davies, a uh, brand that got a couple of years. Okay. In New Jersey, also we're doing Van Dodge before, and this is the new Vice project, so it's a, so, it's a Jack Factory. There. This is so different, dude. It's so crazy looking. Yeah. This purple Lamborghini, the color that we, we choose for the, for the boat. So how fast? You said it goes 70 miles an hour with... with 70, the... and if we add the 600 Mercury's, it will be the next one, it will be around 100 miles per hour. Listen, I have the keys to that booth right there. If you want, you let me know, I'll get you some engines. <laughs> I, there's, 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 there's one and a half in there. <laughs> All right, so where can they go online if they wanted to see more of this boat? Um, I'll give you my business card so you can... Tell it on there because they're watching the video. Oh, okay. Perfect. It would be that the brand is right there, uh, Vice Yachts. Viceyachts.com? Yeah. yeah. All right, let me show them the cabin and then they, they'll see themselves. It's so different, dude. You can take also one of these. Oh, look you at have, this. Like, a toilet over there. And... There's a head, dude. Yeah, look, at, look at that. That is so cool. Actually, I wouldn't have thought that it would have had a, such a... And this will become a small little berth, right? Mm -hmm. So you can go ahead and sleep if you wanted to. Yeah, like something to rest, probably not sleep, but well, for I sure mean, to take a power nap. <laughs> Let me give you some. How cool is this, guys? That is so sick. And this is gonna be the next project that hopefully will be ready next year. Mm -hmm. So this is gonna, gonna look. This is gonna be like the 60 yacht. Well, we got to do a follow-up video. Well, listen, check yourself out on my channel, Alfred Montaner on YouTube. Okay. And uh, we will be in contact. Check me out, all right? Okay. Guys, Thank you very much. Thank this you. thing was so cool. And I'm glad I was able to film you guys. Check, give me your, I'll email you. Alfred okay. Montaner on YouTube. Okay, amazing. Perfect. Thanks a lot, guys. Take care. I mean, I get, I get like comments from you guys all the time. You should have a business card, guys. I haven't had a business card my whole life. If, if it's important enough, somebody's gonna call me. Um, or they'll find me. I don't, I don't wanna be found. <laughs> They're gonna find me, trust me. Somebody's gonna say, hey, I saw you on YouTube. Look at this, coast to coast custom boats. See, this is why I like doing these type of videos, right? Where nobody sees anything. Look at this. Hey, will you watch a chit show? No, no, soy yo, no soy yo, no soy yo. No, no, no este no soy yo. Soy, soy, me veo como siempre. You're not Alfred? I am Alfred, but, but it, it says Bob though. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a thing out here. <laughs> oh, listen, I just did a video on pontoon boats. I know, we saw it. Okay, so that's the best video. Listen, that's right. I went all the way to Knoxville because of you. Yes. For you, right. and I, I didn't want to drive. Final, oh. final thing. Okay, so what's the question do you have? Because I saw a bunch of them. I know you did. I okay. Saw, I saw the whole thing. Okay. I, I'm in love right now with the Avalon. Okay. Warranty wise, the the the, the way it was built mm -hmm. and everything. But. Price. No, but. Yet. Okay. Price is, you know. Yeah, but the market is hot, so right. But here's the thing. Here's what I'll tell you. What a 20 year old told me the other day. You only live once, bro. Oh, okay. well, I believe in that. I believe in so that. So make, make the memories now. Worry about worry. the problems later. Worry, worry about the payments later. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you, man. All right, guys. Over here. 
it doesn't get more real than that guys all right so that's a costa custom boats looks like a cool little boat um some guys over there uh halo this is kind of cool and different that is so awesome you guys let me tell you something my subscribers are the best bro you guys are the best and even my haters i like my haters too because you know what at least they have that notification bell on and as soon as i upload a video they're the first ones to dislike and you know what i i appreciate you the ones that i don't like are the ones that do nothing you do nothings damn it so you got yellowfin over here guys and actually in my other video we saw the 54 yellowfin and uh right now we're walking and talking I like this one here. This is this is this is Black Point uh, Biscayne Bay boat right here. This is it right here. Do some bone fishing. Oh my goodness, I like this a lot. Look at this. It's been a, it's been a nice day, guys. So let me tell you what's been going on with the weather lately. The the weather has been awesome, right? So people have been appreciating like the great weather what's up guys what's going on man what what is what do we got here bro it's my 34 and my 26 streamline you want to check out our newest toilet <laughs> only if you sit on it hey come here listen do me a favor let's walk it real quick let's walk it real quick mo come on peter uh, so so listen only if you sit on it yeah absolutely all right but, but we got to turn off the music bro if not we got barcero music in the background we don't want that over here on the chicho uh, I finally built a boat that Mo fits in the head. We're in Palm Beach. So, West Palm? so do we have the 45 here or no? Uh, we do not. We were going to get a wet slip. It ended up not working out for us. And we were gonna that yeah, okay, so let's let's look at let's look at this over here. Um, let me turn off that radio, Mo, because you're gonna you're gonna mess up my video, bro. You know I don't do edits. I don't do edits, bro. I'm lazy. I'm a lazy guy. I'm real. That's what that's what people like, right? They like that I don't edit. That's right. So we got our little wrap on this too. So here's one of the things, uh, Peter, everybody says they can't get engines, they can't get boats made fast enough for what everybody's trying to get. What's the availability right now for like production for you guys building a streamline? Because I know you guys got the 26. Um, we have, uh, we're doing four 26s a month, so that one's regularly available. Engines are still kind of, uh, are still kind of scarce, but they're starting to show up, you know, trickle in little by little. Mm -hmm. uh, 34, you're looking at, if you take one of the slots that we already have built, mm -hmm. um, about a year wow out. okay so 45 the same so we we got we got everybody's the same as, as it's got a year maybe some are some are even further out yeah, so a lot, of, a but lot it, of companies are way out a lot of companies we're looking at two and three years out and so I'm sure we'll get there so here's the thing now right so if you can't get motors then what do we do in Miami, right? We'll bring out the paddles and go out of exactly. Black Point and I mean, we, will, we, we got the everybody, chicho. Everybody comes equipped with a set of oars. <laughs> Listen, if you're innovative enough, you can get out on the water, guys. What you're going to have to do is get a couple extra friends, right? Everybody, yeah. eight on one or, side, or eight on the other. There's a surplus of electric, electric motors, right? Yeah, exactly. Those torpedo things like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Mo, you're going to sit on that head, bro. Let's Come on. Let's go. Come on, guys. <laughs> Let me see, guys. Come on. Hey, that's an inside joke between Mo and I over there. We did a video actually at one of a smaller show at the West Palm Beach show, right, Mo? Yeah, it was West Palm. Good, 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 good All right, so 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 Mo Mo is gonna show the boat and sell the boat at the same time. <laughs> this, this is the first. This is the first time ever. All right, so okay, so tell me which model this is, and let's try to act serious now right. because we can edit this now. All right, guys, this is Alfred and this is Mo right here from Streamline Boats. So this is a 34 tournament edition. Um, this is actually the official Tito's Vodka Fishing Team boat. Um, it's ran by John Jackson. Um, they fish a couple of tournaments. Um, and this is their tournament boat. This boat is about a year old. And I'm going to go ahead and walk you guys through see what we have on the back. All right, let's speak up a little bit because I don't have you mic'd. Okay. So, so this, uh, this boat here has triple 350 Mercury's. Okay. Or autos. This runs about 65 miles an hour, top speed. Yeah. Put that seat in the back. Nice. So you have a little pull out there. Here. How many gallons, Mo? 55 gallons. 55? Yeah. Oh, nice. Nice and deep, too. And this is this is a used boat? Yeah. This is a fishing team boat and it looks this good? Yeah. <laughs> Those guys in Tito Vox are, are not fishing. They're drinking they're vodka. They're drinking yeah, vodka they're, they're drinking vodka. Fishing. All right. So here we have the rear-facing chair seat. 
Okay. You could also get this in an option where it's a leading post and then um, you could have a full out cooler, you could have a, a mini fridge in there, a little sink on there. So this is also a, a second, a quick, yeah. second station. This one has a, a second station up top. This one is powered, it has Ray Marine Electronics and JL. But that's all preference, right? If somebody yeah, wanted to have yeah. Garmin or anything yeah, like exactly, that? Yeah, exactly, Whatever customer's choice. So I see that there's some storage down here. What's what's going on over here? So nice deep boxes. So if you wanted to go ahead and fish. You know me, I'm... You know everybody's waiting for that, that head. Yeah. Everybody's waiting for the head shot. We got some storage down here, so... Okay, nice. This one has 12 on the side there. The big boys down here. <laughs> Jails. This one has a nice sound system. It's got 16 Ray Marines. So tell me a little bit about this hardtop because I'm digging this. Um, I like this. Is this a, one of your molds that you guys use for this? Yeah, correct. I like this. We offer this type of hardtop with a piping like this. Uh -huh. Piping, and then we also have a, a top similar to the 45, which is a luxury top. That it, we're gonna um, do that on our, one of our 34s. It's coming out within about a week or so. Okay. Um, and it's gonna look just like a, a 45, pretty much a little mini 45. Which is what's what's the beam on this, Mo? This is an 11 foot beam. 11 foot beam. Yeah. The, the weight, the dry weight on this boat is about 12,000 pounds. 12,000 pounds. Yeah. So it's a, it's a nice heavy. Solid boat. You, you know what I really like about this? I love these gunnels here, how thick they are. Literally, you can fight a fish, jump on the gunnels if you want to. And I mean, you're a big fisherman, right? Yeah. I mean, do you try? Yeah. I play one on YouTube. I'm on Instagram fisherman. <laughs> I, I play one on YouTube, bro. <laughs> There's a difference. I'm on Instagram fisherman. Uh, you're not a fisherman, but but we all think we're fishermen. Yeah. And, and <laughs> until the fish and <laughs> the camera. <laughs> all right. Makes it look bigger. So I'm looking at this here. I know that there's got to be a, some some type of door on that side, right? Yeah, it's on this side over here. Uh, okay, but I'll tell you what. Looking at it through here, this console seems like it's pretty big for a 34 foot boat, right? So what do we got going on here? We'll show them that uh, now. So we have another we have live well. Pitch wells, yeah. These are about 20 20 gallons pitch wells. You can turn this into coolers also for storage. So, so the real fishermen, like the guys from Tito, will use this boat to really fish. And then the guys like you and me. We'll use it to store beers. And, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> you see, Mo, Mo's easy to work with, guys. <laughs> I like this. I really do. And, and you have some storage down here as well. And another big locker down here. What's going on down here with this locker here? And you got, you, you got a little chest here as well. Mo, where are you guys building these out of? You're building them in Miami? Yeah. So, so you guys are building the 26, the 34, and the 45? The 45 out of Miami, yeah. Out of Miami. Um, no 26 is here, which we did a video. Yeah, we have a 26. Oh, look at it here. Okay. So, so, so this is a 26, uh, which we did a video. We're, we're, we'll, we'll direct them to that video yeah. because we did a video of this particular model Actually, two different models yeah. at, at the at the West Palm yeah, Beach the West Show. Beach about a couple, a year and a half ago, I believe, or so. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and show them where you're going to sit. But before we do that, let me ask you this. What do we got as far as fuel capacity on something like on this? This, boat, this one has about 370 gallons. Almost 400 on this? I mean, where are you guys trying to go? Bimini and back? And the fishermen, and they still want more. <laughs> and they want more? What? This, one what? Do, this, one, this particular boat does cruising like at 40, about 1.2 miles per gallon. So, so what's the top speed on it? 65. 65? How, how far up can you go as far as horsepower? Um, um, we have some that are coming out. With, we could put up to 450 yards on it. Up to 450 yeah, yards? Yeah. Do you think somebody can put twin uh, 600s if they had to? You could, but it's just going to be pretty expensive. But I, I, I don't know. Listen, I, 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 I've seen everything, bro. Yeah, yeah. Just give the people options. You give them options. Say yay or nay. That's all you they need to hear. There you go. If you want it, we'll build it for you. <laughs> All right, guys. He's going to open up. All right, guys. Get ready. So, yeah, let me let me go in there. All right. So so here's here's the head. The best part of the whole boat. Wait for it. Wow, that is deep, dude. Holy smack. 
Wait a second. Smaller console, we're actually going to get one with a bigger space and we're going to call it our sleeper. What do you mean? So, oh, so you're not going to have that? Yeah, we're going to take off a little bit of the front seat. That way you have more space so two people can lay in here overnight. That is super. We're going to put AC and stuff in here. Dude, so. this is a big, <laughs> big console, dude. No, oh, come on. Don't do this to yourself. Get, you, you want the newspaper? Let me know. <laughs> Wait for <laughs> All right. Um, all right. So listen, let's talk about the what everybody wants to wait. Wait, let me see that. Let me see that. See that uh, streamline, you know, sexiness. Oof. All right. Nice, nice and clean. Listen, I, I, I got to disagree, bro. I don't think those guys are fishing, bro. I think that's just an excuse to say, hey, I'm going fishing. <laughs> all right. So. Mo, what are we looking at as far as price on something like this? So on a, on a boat like this, fully loaded, this fishing tournament edition, you're like up around maybe 340. That's what we're at on a, on a boat similar to this. Build. 340. Where can they go online to go ahead and go get more information? Uh, Streamlineboats.com. You can go ahead and build yours out. If not, you can give us a call at our factory um, or find us on Instagram at Streamline Boats, and we can go ahead and help you out. And whenever, you know, if you want to come and schedule a factory tour or see each other, just give us a call, and we're more than glad to help you. All right, guys. Well, listen, I want to thank Peter, Mo, and that, that huge head, bro. <laughs> guys, we're out of here at the Palm Beach International Boat Show. We're going to continue, guys, <laughs> over here, guys.